Hey guys, my name is Kenyatta and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, do not forget to subscribe. If you're not new here, then what's good? How you doing? How you living? What is up? Welcome back to another video. So in this video, we are going to be reviewing Aunt Jackie's. Let me push y'all back a little bit. We're going to be reviewing Aunt Jackie, one of her collections. It is the Aloe and Mint Recipes collection that I have been trying to review forever. And now here we go. So let's go through today's lineup. So I got this at my local beauty supply store. And I just broke one of the products. <laughs> so I broke the top off of it. Thank God it has seal. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, okay. So we have, yes, local beauty supply store is where I got all of this. The line includes five products and everything is $9.99. So first we have the Flawless Pattern Perfecting Pudding. Looks like this. So it says hydrates, shines, and defines for long lasting curls and coils. It has no mineral oil and no silicones. It's enriched with aloe, mint, and manuka honey. Ooh, manuka honey. So it says, get ready to experience superior definition, enhanced with Manuka Honey Flawless, helps your curl pattern become distinctively smoother, softer, and beautifully defined without feeling heavy, crunchy, or tacky. This is 10 fluid ounces. Next up, we have the Hydrate Me. It's the leave-in conditioning cream. Looks like this. This, um... Hydrating leave-in moisture therapy softens texture for easy combing, enriched with aloe, mint, hemp seed oil, and marshmallow root. Hemp seed and marshmallow root are blended into this leave-in recipe that helps replenish and seal in moisture throughout every strand. Ultra lightweight, both hair and scalp reap the benefits of this oil moisture therapy formulated to hydrate hair, making it softer, making it softer and easy to comb. Also 10 fluid ounces. We have Cool It, the stimulating moisturizing conditioner. Softens, conditions, and moistures, and what? It moisturizes for healthier looking and filling hair. Enriched with aloe, mint, rosemary, and lemongrass. Are your strands ready for a spa-like experience? This Aunt Jackie's Owl and Mint Conditioning Recipe includes rosemary and lemongrass to help your hair to feel and look gloriously transformed from dry and lackluster to super soft and revitalized. Your hair and scalp will love this stimulation. See you. The stimulation. <laughs> so this is given, okay, this is about to be one of those conditioners that we're going to feel it. Like a, this is like a first impression as well, you guys, because I haven't used like any of these products before. But I'll read the description. Right now, I'm just like reading what's on the front of the product. We'll talk about as we use each product, we'll read the back and like the instructions and what they're telling you, like how to use it. So this is Lather Up. It's the Sulfate Free Stimulating Shampoo Cream. So it moisturizes and thoroughly cleans hair and scalp without stripping natural oils. It's enriched with aloe, mint, I, this, I always <laughs> butcher this together for some reason, apple, cider, vinegar, and shea butter. So Wash Day just got better with this stimulating aromatherapy hair bath. Blended with nature's remedies for scalp health and softness, your hair will thank you for the invigorating experience. So all of these are 10 fluid ounces. This is the one I broke, right? <laughs> I'm excited about the squeeze out. Like I feel like that's just gonna make this wash day so much easier. Last product is the Aloe and Mint Recipes Wake Up Refresher Spray. Okay, wasn't expecting that. Revives dry hair, face, and skin. So this is like a body mist. I thought this was just a hair product. It's enriched with aloe, mint, jojoba, and vitamin E. Exhilarating refreshment for your curls, face, and skin are a few pumps away. Wake up 
helps to enliven and lightly hydrate and condition curls, waves, coils, and skin with a satisfying dose of hopal, owl, mint, and vitamin E. So this is four fluid ounces. All $9.99, local beauty supply store. So let's get into it. We see like the state of the hair. It's been in this protective hairstyle for like, ooh, this, I gotta throw this ponytail holder away. Do y'all do that? Like when it starts getting like real stretched out like that? You can't even see because it's all black, but like right there, I start to throw it away. So I feel like it's, I don't know, it's more likely that it's gonna snag my hair. But as we can see, like it's still in those little twists. So we need to take it out and get started with the shampoo. So the shampoo, since this is our first product, no <laughs> they got this big security tag over the instructions well that's just like the little description it's probably similar to what was us uh, it was probably this little thing is covering up some of our <laughs> details but it's probably the same as what's described on here we just need to know the directions so the the direction state squeeze into the palm of your hand then rub hands together and gently work into a lather on wet hair do not shampoo vigorously for dense and thickened textures form your hands like a claw massage your scalp then gently rake through from scalp and roots to ends carefully detangling as you go rinse thoroughly and repeat for optimal results, follow with the Hydrate Me. The Cool It is basically telling you, like, use this entire line if you want great results, which is what we're doing. So it's basically saying do not just put this directly into your scalp and start, like, you know, scrubbing to death like they do in the commercials. This is, like, a gentle way to shampoo. Like, put it in your hands, massage it, let it work, and then, like, massage it into your scalp and then work it down work it down to your ends but I feel like I'm like I get it but I'm probably going to do a little bit of both just out of muscle memory like putting it in my hands we naturally do it then put it in your hair so we gonna get started but first we got to take down we got to take out these rubber bands came out so much more smoother. I need to get some scissors and stuff. I don't feel like it.
need your makeup, darling Oh, you running out of time, huh? The time ain't even real, you really need to chill It's all an illusion You get every stuff in the future Whatever it is you try to see You can sit down and just believe But I wouldn't never be the same old thing Okay, so this is what the hair looks like after we have shampooed. I like the way it felt. It was very moisturizing. It wasn't, it, I think it said it wasn't supposed to strip your hair, but yeah without stripping natural oils and i feel like my hair we're not starting off like super dry like when we go in with the conditioner mm. okay <laughs> my bad we got to shut the door jeremiah doing the most okay. next let's section the hair off So now we're gonna go in with the conditioner. I gotta remember, take off all these seals. I'm gonna take a food break when it's time to deep condition because there, this line doesn't have a deep conditioner. So we're just gonna deep condition with this. I'm just gonna let this sit. We need to get our oils. grape seed and my olive oil so let's spray the hair down and get to it I feel like anytime like you spray your hair down and then you start like working a product in your hair and it's like kind of going everywhere it's like that's how you know the slip like <laughs> you just like breaking through like your hair it's giving slip okay we got some clumping even though this is not a deep conditioner it smells good is it the rosemary All right guys, so we just gonna work through the rest of the sections. Like I said, this has incredible slip, so I think we good as far as like working out some detangles. No. Oh, even deny it every time I try it. One look at my eyes and I'm lying, lying. Body to body, skin to skin.
completely applied and we are just gonna let this sit it's given I think I'm gonna just do like 30 minutes today let this sit get our, get our satin scrunchie little bunny bun it's gonna like i said i'll be back in 30 minutes i'm about to take a food break to <laughs> replenish and then we'll be back to style all right guys so we are back 
and we are ready to style. This is what the hair looks like after we take out the um, technically conditioner, but I treated it like a deep conditioner. Okay. All right, so we have, from this line we have a perfecting put-in and a leave-in conditioner. So, <clears throat> let's get these seals taken off. I still can't believe I dropped the other <laughs> That um I didn't mention, but that conditioner, like because of the slip and the consistency of it, like, I think I'm gonna fly through that product. I think it's only gonna take like two or three use because it's not like thick. You know what I'm saying? It's very creamy. It's like water-based. So it just, I think it's easy to be like heavy handed with it. I feel like I don't have enough space and I'm literally <laughs> like making a mess of things. I think what we need to do is get rid of what we've already used. Like that's what we need to do. There we go. I feel like you really got to be careful with these products, like really paying attention to like what you're grabbing because I almost had a moment just now. They all say something different. So I feel like that's good. As far as like the name right here, they all say something different, but the packaging is exactly the same. So like not paying attention, you can like grab the wrong product because I just had a moment for some reason and I thought like, I thought that the um, shampoo said hydrate me. So I was like, oh my God, did I use the wrong product? I thought I was shampooing with the leave-in cream instead of the, <laughs> cause I think they both say cream too. Yeah, like the shampoo cream, but it says lather up. And I was like about to have a moment. Once I opened it, it realized it still, I just took it out, but it just had the seal. I was like, okay, cool. <laughs> they all, it's all the same packaging. There's nothing that, distinguishes the products other than like the labels of the hydrate me lather up and flawless because sometimes you know the packaging for each product will be different you may have something that's like the only thing different is the refresher spray but normally you know like a lot of times the shampoo and the conditioner may be in like bottles like this like the shampoo and conditioner will look like this but then like the stylers might be in different packaging, like jars or whatever. So it's interesting. They just um, decided to do squeeze tubes all the way around. I think I'm gonna use a detangling brush too to style. Okay. All right, let's get to it. So first we're, I'm gonna go in with the leave-in. Okay, it's got a thicker consistency than um, the conditioner. Yeah, it's like this, almost like a lotion. So I'm gonna use the detangling brush to like work in the leave-in conditioner. Well, the leave-in cream. I'm just used to leave-in conditioners, like being called leave-in conditioners, not leave-in cream. There's that. And then it says, okay, these little stickers are really sending me because it's like right on the directions. You know, I know me when I'm using a new product, I like to see, I just like to see how they say you should use it. Like, I feel like if you've been doing your hair and doing like wash and go routines, you probably just know what a product is supposed to do. But sometimes I just like reading it because it surprises you. Like, had I not read this, I wouldn't have known that this was for your face and your body, you know? <laughs> like, so I'd just be liking to read it, but they didn't smack this thing on here. I 
The gist of it is what we're doing though, like putting it in there. It recommends a wide tooth comb to kind of help like detangle and then just taking it like a section at a time, which we're gonna do and just, you know, basically with, basically the way you use a leave-in conditioner, there's nothing like um, extra that they're recommending. I just wish they would stop putting those stickers. Not all beauty supply stores do that. It's just that one in particular for some reason feels the need to do that. So this is the pudding. We're gonna follow up with the pudding and then I'm gonna use like my fingers. So this, you can use this. It says it's best for type three and four curly hair textures and for wash and goes. Twist and braid outs, bantu knots and any other styles basically. And it says apply by smoothing flawless to sections of wet or damp clean hair from roots to ends. Use less for short fine hair and more as needed for longer denser textures and then style as desired. So pretty much just saying like whatever you want to use this for you can. So this is what it looks like. They all pretty much smell the same. Like even though some of them have like different has different ingredient. Ooh. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to use a lot of this. It's making me nervous. It, it It's like sticky. I think this piece does not belong here. Stay in your own lane. Okay. I think what I'm going to do is be heavier on the leave-in conditioner and not use as much until i really know like how this works in my hair with the pudding because you guys i can't even tell you the last time i've used the pudding so that's another reason like i feel like if you are used to using something like this then you probably already know like how it turns out once your hair is dry how much you need to use like what's the proportion I mean, they said if your hair is thin or has a finer texture, like you don't need to be heavy handed. My hair is thicker. So it said, you know, use as much as you can use more. Just use as much as you need. So we're not going to overdo it. I don't know. Maybe it just went on weird because now that I'm like working it in and like curling it, you can't, you can barely see the product now. It's just when it went on white like that, I thought I saw a ghost. Like, I was like, no. But like, as you like uh, style it, like, it doesn't look as crazy. Okay. So that's what it looks like. Okay. We're about to listen to some music and we're going to do that to each section. Baby, so I'm 
turn me round. Treat me like a watch, bust me down. On the kitchen floor, right on that towel. It's my and I want it now. Tell me how you want it. Put me on my back, on my stomach. Baby, let me blow it like a trumpet. I can do it all. I can probably suck a watermelon to a straw. Believe me, every other day, you make new hair. Come take me out this move, Blair. I be waiting on you some more. Completely applied. We got in the leave in cream and we got in the pudding. So, I mean, it's giving like there's gonna be definition. I hope so. Like, I'm really trying to rack my brain for the last time I've used a pudding for a wash and go. So, here we go. I am gonna air dry today. So, we will do that and then I'll come back tomorrow with the results. 
but my first impressions so far like speaking before it dries like i think i think it's a winner like i feel like something about the consistency of the leave-in cream helps with hydrating your curls like after you've done your cleansing system to kind of give that moisture back in and then the pudding like i feel like it gives your hair definition but i saw i was like we gotta wait for it to dry but that's my thoughts right now i like it i like every product we so so far you didn't see this this is the only thing we didn't use because i think i'm just going to use it tomorrow like once we take it down i'm just going to use it to spray and refresh but i probably will not use it for like my skin and stuff <laughs> it's gonna be a hair product for me but i will see you guys tomorrow hey guys it's the next day so we are going to take the hair down see what it's given i air dried for a little bit and then i just completely put my hair up so it wasn't 100 percent dry when i put it up into the pineapple So that pudding, <laughs> it gives absolute definition. No volume, just definition. <laughs> I mean, I could like pick it out, but I never, I mean, I do it sometimes, but I feel like when you know your hair is just gonna get bigger anyway, it's like, okay. All right guys, so I took my hair down and just went ahead and sprayed the refresher spray. Um, are we focused? We were doing good yesterday. There we go. What do we got here? The directions say, as a hair refresher, what I just did, spray all over hair to revive curls, waves, and coils, and to cover hair. <laughs> Okay, so I guess if your hair is smelling a little weird, it acts as a neutralizer. So, um, and to cover hair odor as a face and body refresher, hold about five inches from face or hold close to body and spray. I still feel like that is so crazy that this can... I think I haven't yet to use anything that's like, like a three-in-one. Like if I use it for my face, then I don't use it for my hair and like vice versa so that's like interesting but yeah we just sprayed it you know not that my hair needs to be refreshed but i just wanted y'all to see like how it sprays and what it does because i don't really use these until it's time to refresh and this is day one here so there's that i wonder if i like i have not no I haven't been like wearing my hair to the side and then without really no volume this is i don't know if i want to push it to the side anyway there's like a weird piece right here i'm just going to go in with some of the the leave-in cream so i thought about it and i was like you know what the last time when I use, remember I was trying to uh, remember the last time I used pudding? It was when I used to do um, rod sets. So I would go in with that uh, Pantene there. Um, they had a pudding with their line. And I used to go in with that first before I went with any type of mousse. And it would make my hair like really like easy to mold and then go in with the mousse. That's where, that's when I used to use it. That's why I couldn't remember if I had used it before, because like on a wash and go, because I don't think I have, I always use some form of cream or a gel. 
so <clears throat> I feel like for this line if you are looking for like absolute precision like um, every hair in place like type thing this is the line for you because it dried down exactly how I left yesterday like this is exactly how it looked there's like a few pieces in the front from I think where I just like laid my scarf but like otherwise this little piece here though is bothering me yeah the curls are like what <laughs> i mean they didn't miss a beat yeah i think i'm gonna love this as this gets bigger and then i just gotta put some edge control like on the front part of it because the way this is like so perfect any manipulation is just going to frizz it out so this is how the hair turned out like i said i could absolutely go in with the pick right now and then like you know make this larger but i don't want to i just want to leave it like this and let it do its own thing all right guys so overall i like the product line i feel like for the cost absolutely every product was 9.99 um i didn't have any concerns about like any ingredients that were being used i know like last night like the mint in my opinion is very subtle but it has a like a subtle like after the fact like you can smell it like when my hair was put up and i was like going to bed i was like you can definitely smell that mint now but like now like it's, it's subtle it's not like overbearing i didn't feel like it was overbearing as i was putting the products in my hair you know or anything but like once my hair was like up and i think i may have that may have okay we can talk that may have had a lot to do with the fact that my hair was still a little bit wet when I put it up and I think that's why like the smell was like seeping through my bonnet but otherwise now that it's like dry and it's the next morning like I'm not smelling anything so yeah I feel like it gave obviously a lot of definition there is shine which I think like I said if you evolve a volume girly I feel like you just got to go in and manipulate your hair because the definition is there and then now all you got to do is get your pick get your scrunchies and like stretch it out and make it big but I normally leave my hair like this because it gets pretty wild by the third day okay so these are the results I love it all right guys Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you're not already, make sure to subscribe to my channel. If you want to see more videos like this where I review product lines, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Thank you guys again so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.
falling, why you making problems? I've been silent, why you making problems? I'm a problem, being rich is not my fault You decide, who you think you should reside with? I've been quiet, part of me 